Welcome to today's seated or lying down meditation. Make sure that you have a comfortable position. Again, whether you are seated or lying down. Get any of the wriggles out. Any of the deep breaths. Pulling them all the way in. Maybe a nice comfortable sigh to release. You can do that a few times. Just helping your mind and your body to settle in just a little easier to where you are. Today, as we relax and find ourselves through presence, through awareness, I'd like you to evaluate your energy. Currently, how are you feeling right now in the moment? Are you tired? Or are you energetic? Or are you somewhere in between? evaluating our energy each day is a very smart focal point to have. And paying attention each day to see how things may have changed one way or the other. We can get a grasp on the direction our body is going and what may have contributed to it leading this way. So evaluate your energy. If you feel that you have low energy today, what might be draining it? Can you get to that point to figure out where that energy leak might be? You also might be on the complete opposite end of the spectrum and have a complete abundance of energy right now. And do the same thing. Where might that abundance of energy be coming from? Or what might it be because of? Did you have an amazing sleep last night? Or maybe it wasn't so great. Is there something else in your life right now that might be taking a lot of mental space? Or you may have a practice that gives you back mental space, mental energy. Now whatever your evaluation is, whether you have an abundance of energy or if you are low in energy. Is there something that you need to do to change this? And if you have an abundance of energy, maybe today might be the day to do that extra activity, that slightly more intense workout. Or if you evaluated that you have low energy and maybe you got to the bottom of it. You got to the reason why you're feeling a little tired or drained. What can you do to either reduce the problem or cut it out completely? What can you change in your life starting today, starting right now? That will change this low energy. Now you might be completely in the middle. Not too high in the energy or not too low. That Goldilocks place. And if you are, that might mean that you are getting the right amount of sleep, the correct type of sleep. 
you're doing all the correct things before bedtime. And also getting a nice restful sleep. So that might mean you just continue to do what you've been doing. But paying attention. Evaluate your energy. If you drew a graph, a graph of the past week or even just a few days, what might that energy graph look like? Has it been pretty steady and even? Or does it go up and down like the peaks and valleys that you might see on some of those graphs online? Now it doesn't really matter what this past week, what the graph might look like. But the important thing is to get to the bottom of whatever is causing this up and down. And finding that nice, even balance where you have a good amount of energy. Where you wake up and you feel that you really want to tackle the day. To get those things done that you may have been putting off for quite a while. So take a few minutes right now. To just start to think. What is deeper down? What is under the layers of this energy level? Again, if it's at the right level, keep doing what you are doing. But if not, let's get to the bottom of it. And by getting to the bottom of it, doing something about it. Change one habit, one thing that you do. Change something like your routine to wind down before bed. The temperature of your bedroom. Anything else that might help you to relax before actually falling asleep like a nighttime meditation. Or even journaling before you go to sleep. Continue to get to the bottom, trying all the different things that you know or that other people around you know to help your night's sleep be amazing and your wake-up energy be perfect. Keep working towards that point. Every morning when you wake up, evaluate your energy again and again. Find the things that work for you and continue to work towards that. You're more than welcome to lay here and just imagine getting deeper and deeper into the layers of your mind, getting to the bottom of what your mind and body is telling you, how you can change or cut out this thing that's bringing the energy down, making it low. Spending time just to think of the different things that you're currently doing that you may want to cut out. And when you've spent that time, take what you can into your day and just remember it here and there throughout the day. Almost like a little post-it note just coming back to you to remind you of your goal. And then again tomorrow, either do this meditation when you wake up, or this guidance when you wake up, or just simply evaluate your energy and imagine the graph. What direction is your graph going in? Staying on track to get your energy to a level that is perfect for you. Have the most amazing day. And take what you can from this sitting, this time here, getting closer to your mind and body. Take that and make today amazing. Thank you for doing this for you, for everyone else around you. Have a great day.